Guard RFK Jr. made his announcement there a short time ago. You heard him live here on News Nation Now. Nicole Shanahan, the 38 year old who comes out of the world of technology, is his running mate in this independent run for president. Geraldo Rivera is still with me on that and all the breaking news we've been covering uh, today. Uh, your thoughts here on, on the pick? My first uh, thought was that she's like a female Andrew Yang or Vivek Ramaswamy. She comes out of tech. Uh, she's young, she's admirable, she's competent, uh, she's honorable, she's wealthy, she's wonderful, she's also inexperienced, <laughs> unproven in government, and unlikely to attract many, many votes. She got a lot uh, of money, but, right? Uh, Do you think you that know, matters? In terms of some, uh, she can, uh, yeah, she can sell fund, yeah. Yeah. You think that's why I, she was I picked? Do think Remember when RFK was on with Chris, with Chris Cuomo? He pressed him on that, and um, and Kennedy said, "No, no, no. I would have picked. Uh, you know, this pick would. I'd make it anyway. I'd make this pick anyway." But as you see there, she's donated a lot of money. She has helped to fund his Super Bowl ad. I mean, it takes money also to get on these ballots, right? If you had, uh, you know, two people and they were otherwise equal, and one had a pocket full of money and the other was uh, was pulling up uh, peanuts and dust, right? I think I'd take the pocket full of money. That's why that's uh, people pick you over I, me you know, in that I regard. Think, I think Joe. <laughs> 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 uh, I, I like Joe Kennedy. I mean, Joe Kennedy. Yeah, he was I like great too, Ronald. Kennedy Ronald. He's, he, <laughs> I love all the Kennedys. And Joe Kennedy's great too, and <laughs> the, the senior and junior. Right. Uh, but uh, RFK Jr. is a wonderful guy who seems to have gone a bit astray with the, uh, with the vaccine denialism. Uh, I wish him well. I, I, I thought he would be polling more powerfully than he is lately. He's been over or around 20 for a long time. Now I notice the later, latest poll is down to 10. Yeah. Uh, so he really does have to accelerate. It's, this was not only, you know, because he had to get a running mate to be on the ballot in 26 of the states. That's why uh, he was under a time crunch to pick a running mate. I'm, I'm not sure that this will elevate the visibility, though, uh, Connell, of his campaign. Now, in fairness, most times running mates don't. You know, they don't matter. At the end of the day, we go back afterwards. We make a big deal when they're picked. But in this case, he had to have one, uh, whoever it was, to get on the ballot. And I wonder if he will, you know, I'm not saying he's going to win or even win any states, but have an impact in some of those states. I mean, um, you know, you get 10 percent in, in a certain state that could, uh, you know, in a close one, it could matter. If uh, if Trump truly had uh, had uh, guts, I, I would have uh, suggested that Trump take RFK Jr. Uh, as his running mate. It <laughs> would have been a far more vivid uh, announcement. It would have attracted everybody's attention. It would have been, no, uh, I think, been a, a, a whip saw help to Trump in his polling. Uh, yeah. I, because I really do believe that at his heart of hearts, right. and, you know, I'm a three-time winner of the Kennedy Award. I, 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 I to throw in there. I know the family pretty well. Uh, and and this, this guy's competent. Uh, I remember when he was uh, uh, at several environmental groups on the Hudson River. He almost right. single-handedly helped them and tribal New York clean up that uh, the great uh, tributary, the, uh, the Hudson River that goes, you know, all the way upstate, all the way. Mm -hmm. uh, he has created New York as the, one of the great harbors of the world. He helped clean it up in a really meaningful way. Uh, had a very good reputation until he kind of nosedived because of that on the, insistence on uh, all these conspiracies. On the theories. vaccines and what have you. Um, now, the family, his famous family, for the most part, or a lot of them, a lot of the big names are, are not for him, right? Well, you know, I, I, it's, uh, when you get a, a clan that big, True. my father was one of 17 children, so I can relate. When you get a, a group that big, uh, there's all kinds of factions. Yes. And maybe he thought that it was his turn, uh, and the other members of the family said, no, there are others uh, ahead of you for one reason or another. I don't know. I don't know the politics of the, uh, the internal workings of the Kennedy clan. I do know that there's an awful lot of them, mm -hmm. uh, you know, and, uh, you know, they just, you know, he just did not pick up any steam. I, I think that all, I think that they were turned off by that vaccine stuff, yeah, too. Yeah, they might have been. They might have been. Uh, you know, you know. I, I, I think that he went, he went just too far. Let me run here. A bridge too far for Geraldo. I'm sorry to interrupt. A bridge too yeah. far for many of the family. Let me run here so I can get back at the top of the hour with our top stories. We love having you on, as always, the great Geraldo Rivera. Uh, more on Kennedy and Baltimore and everything else when we come back. Don't go away. Thanks so much for watching. Just go to joinnn.com to find News Nation on your television provider. And don't forget to click the red subscribe button below to get more of News Nation's fact-driven, unbiased coverage.